Hello, I'm Drone Pin and welcome to Salt 2, which is a game available right now. As always, I have a link in the description down below if you want to check this one out for yourself and wishlist it, all that good stuff. So what is Salt 2, you might be asking yourself? Salt 2 is an open world pirate game focused on exploration, survival and crafting. Set sail across an infinite procedural world with just you and your ship. Explore islands filled with quests, caves, towns, pirates and secrets. Level up your skills, craft, hunt, fish and loot and decorate your ship. So yeah, open world survival game set in a kind of pirate universe. I like that. There's not too many of those. I do like my pirate games. This one is in early access as well. Just uh, thought I'd mention that one. Uh, but yeah, not many good not many good pirate games out these days and even fewer in the sort of survival genre. Um, so this one does have gamepad support as well. I think I'll just quickly mention that because uh, I know people do like to use their gamepads. So if I just move my Xbox controller, there it is plugged in. You can use your gamepad. I'm going to use the keyboard and mouse, but if you want to use a gamepad, it has full support for that as well. Um, so let's get into this one. I've got my name down and then you can plumb in any world seed you want. You can just, um, you know, randomize the seed as well. We'll just go with iFake. There we go. That's a good one. Um, so let's get going. I think there's a little bit of an intro, so I'll let that play out. I'm pretty sure there was anyway. It seems the gods have smiled upon you today. A stranger in a strange land. Adrift. Alone. Nevertheless, I'm afraid I must leave now. Good luck. Okay, so there we go. So uh, bot uh, top right, we've got a uh, quest, and that is New Beginnings. Read the note on the table. Uh, it does have a kind of, I guess, kind of, it's not cell shaded, is it? I forget the term for it. But yeah, it's kind of a unique look as well, which I think is kind of cool. Uh, so let's come over here, and I think it's this one. We've got, a, yeah, read this note from the stranger. Uh, I'm not going to read it because I've already read that. But uh, if you guys want to read that, uh, pause the video and uh, read it. But um, yeah, I'm not going to read that. So... Uh, there we go. So let's put that away because we don't need to do that. Find the cave. Oh, I need to pick up some of this stuff. Uh, cutlass. So we've got a uh, primary and a secondary attack. Uh, again, I've read all this, so I'll let you guys uh, pause the video. We've got a map as well, which is going to be pretty handy. So that's going to be good. And then we need the compass. We also need the sextant because we're going to need that to uh, navigate as well. And then I'm going to take the empty bottle. Um... And I think we'll take... Uh, oh, no, that's the cartographer's station. We don't need to use that yet. I think there was something else to pick up as well, wasn't there? Um, but tab is the inventory. And then we're going to put that. And we're going to equip that. There we go. And then down here, we've got our health and our stamina. And then this is like our uh, hunger bar as well. Uh, we need to eat and drink, I think, in this game as well. We can pick up some of these uh, sticks. As we do as well, our... Um, I think it's in here somewhere. Where is it? Skills. Skills. There we go. As we sort... The more we, you know, pick up herbs, mine, that sort of thing, our skills will go up as well. So, um, yeah. Uh, seems pretty cool. I played it for about 15, 20 minutes. Enjoyed myself. Let's pick some rock. Oh, no, there's no rocks. I need to pick some rocks up. We've got to go to a cave, which is just over. It's not too far away at all. Uh, we could explore the rest of the island, I guess. I never actually did that, but um, I think we'll just get crackalacking on. So there we go. So we found the cave. And there was a bear in there when I played it. So um, we'll see how that goes. But there we are. Let's pick up. Oh, no, I can't do anything with that, I don't think, just yet. Uh, let's come into here. Let's go to the cave. And we'll press F to enter. And then there is a bear somewhere in here. Where are you, bear? Oh, there you are. We have to kill you with a cutlass, which... I don't really fancy taking on a bear with a cutlass, but there you go. There we go, yeah. I don't fancy that, but there you are. That's what we got to do. So let's go in the chest. So throughout our adventure, you'll find crafting, crafting recipes. So we're just going to take uh, all of that. And uh, we then need to go in... I think it was this chest... 
There we are. We're just going to take all of that loot with us. If we hold F, we take it all. Take the empty bottles as well. We'll open the barrel up, but there's nothing in there. Um, there is a pick, so we'll have that. We'll have some cash. We'll have a few bananas. Ugh, I hate bananas, but there we go. And then there we go as well. If you want to read that, just pause the video and uh, you can read it. So there we go. But I've already read it. So uh, let's come over here. I think there was some more loot in here, wasn't there? Uh, was there more loot or not? Yeah, there we go. I thought there was. There we are. There's a little bit more somewhere else as well. No? Was that it? Oh dear. You don't look very help healthy, do you? Ah, there we go. He does not look too healthy. Bit of honey, we'll have that. Take these mushrooms as well. Uh, I can't remember, can I equip the... I think I can actually equip that, right? There we go, put it in one. We'll take the compass in two. We'll have the sextant in three. And we'll have the copper pickaxe in four. There we go, that's pretty good. So, there we go. And then I'm going to pick up all these mushrooms because uh, we might want those. There we go. Actually pick them up, not swing your sword pin. There we go. <laughs> That's all good. Uh, I think there is a... Uh, yeah, there's different tabs for the various things as well. So like our uh, weapons, that sort of thing. Armor, food. Uh, we can do some cooking, I think. We may have just found enough. Right, let's go out there. And we've basically got to build our ship and get out here. So um, return to camp. But uh, health potions are crucial in surviving combat. So there we go. Or you can use the D-pad. So I'm going to go there and I'm going to cook. We've got some cooking oil and we've got uh, enough to do some cooked bear. So we're going to do that. Cook the bear. There we go. And then I think that is now in my inventory, right? Yeah, there we go. We've got cooked bear. So that's brilliant. Uh, it gives us a little bit of food and uh, it gives us health as well. There is no drinking, I don't think, uh, actually. Thinking about that. Let's grab some plant fibers because we are going to need that. Uh, we could explore the island a little bit more. It didn't actually do that, so uh, we could do that. Although we could just crack on to the next mission, couldn't we? Hmm. Yeah, let's crack on to the next mission, I think. Why not? Because uh, let's get the boat. Uh, this is the kind of start island. Uh, you would have to then go and talk to some people. So, yeah, let's, uh, let's just get going, I think. We won't worry too much about that. Uh, time is a ticking. There is a day-night cycle as well, so... Uh, raft crafted so we need to go to the uh, cartographer's station and we need to craft the raft which we picked up all the supplies in that um, in that camp so there we go that's all done now as well right so then we've got to place our raft if we go to there and then we can place that down place it we then get our plant there we go I don't think there are any bruises in the game either um don't think there are any bruises. Uh, find the cartographer table and the coordinates on your map. So, I've got to actually go and speak to a cartographer now. And, uh, where was he? Click the squares. Huh. Where was he? Oh, I think actually I've got to read. Uh, I've got to read the recipes first. Let's read those. I'm sure there was a map somewhere actually that I had to put on. And look, there we go. We've learnt the recipes. Ah, there we are. Location. So, waypoint is there. So, it is 8 east and 0 south. So, we basically want to just sail east, I think, from where we are. We'll get our stuff out. I don't think there are any Bruce's in the game. So, that is good. We're going to be troubled by Bruce. So, let's get the compass out. So, we want to go east, which is that way. It might be that island, but I think it's probably the next one over. And then if we get our sextant out as well, we can take a reading. So we're at zero, zero. So if we just basically sail east, we should be good to go. So if we go that way, it's kind of in that direction, isn't it? Yeah, okay. So, uh, oh, we've got to lower the sail first. So let's do that. And then we can get on the wheel and steer this sucker. And then there's a little bit of red sort of cloth that shows you you're roughly pointing straight. So I am then going to sail to the um, to this place. We've got to talk to a cartographer who then gives us another mission. And I think that's about as far as I got. Um, but uh, yeah, I think the graphics are really cool. The ocean looks fantastic as well, I have to say. Um, 
And uh, yeah, I'll say not many pirate games. So uh, this could be the island, but I don't think it is. So uh, I could just get off and, you know, use my uh, machine, you know, compass and that sort of thing. So just take a reading. So we're heading one east and we need to go to eight east. There we are at the moment. It's zero, zero there. And we've got to go there. So I think if we just stay on this bearing, just take another quick bearing just to make sure. But yeah, we're roughly heading in the right direction. So as long as we just stay on this course, we should be good. And we'll just keep going until we find uh, what we're looking for. So yeah, let me just keep going. I may as well cut away now and um, we'll, uh, we'll pick it up once we find where we're looking for. Okay, right, I think this is where we've got to go. I'm just taking a reading. Yeah, 7 east by 0 south. So, yeah, I think this is the place that we're looking for. And we're looking for a cartographer. So, uh, yeah, so find the cartographer at the coordinates using the map you found on the table. So, there we go. So, yeah, that took a little bit of time. I maybe suggest um, having it so that the cartographer is not so quite so far away. Uh, it wasn't too far away for me when I did my little test game. So... Uh, I guess we just got unlucky with the spawns or something. It will park there. We can respawn it as well. So this now should be a kind of friendly pirate village with merchants and all that sort of stuff in it. Um, we're the traveller. We're looking for the cartographer. He was in a... I think he was in a house. Is that him? There we go. The cartographer. That's it. Perfect. So we're in the cartographer's shop now, and I think he gives me a quest. Uh, you've got, you look like you've got a new, a new, new sailor look about you. Um, uh, you're looking for, to, for a master navigator to take you under his wing, yes. Uh, don't be ridiculous. You're looking at one. Uh, this, this air, this hair didn't uh, get this beautiful from sunshine alone. Okay, let's go with that. Uh, first, a sailor doesn't need, doesn't sail a dinghy, a dinghy hole raft. Uh, you'll need a proper ship. Yeah, the Wave Skipper. That's good. So the Wave Skipper is a fantastic ship for young and old sailors alike. Designed last century by a navigator named Bertram. Uh, there we go. Don't need a history lesson. Um, I see. I get carried away sometimes. My apologies. At any rate, uh, you'll need lots of materials to craft it. I'd be willing to give you the supplies if you uh, do something for me first. Okay, quid pro quo. I think he wants me to like attack a uh, pirate island or something. Yeah, murder every last pirate until I get my um, excuse me. Yeah. So there we go. He just wants his compass back. So there we are. So that's good. Um, I think we could do some crafting and stuff because we come to here. The wave skipper is that, but we need like uh, a bunch of stuff that we don't have. I don't think we can just get that. Uh, we have to do this quest. I think. Um, Oh, I can climb up there. Can I sleep? Oh, I can rest. Okay, yeah, I can. All right, let's jump down anyway. Uh, where's the door to this place? Let's go around and we'll talk to everybody else first. Uh, so where is the... Uh, there's a job board there. Where is the uh, thing? I think I've got a... Uh, where are we? Uh, inventory. Maps. So that's the Pirate Island. So that is seven... All right, okay. So that is there. Damn. So that's that's north of us. So we basically just need to travel north and we should be able to find those guys. Uh, well, let's do that, shall we? I don't know if anybody else has any quests. No. I don't think anybody did when I ran around. Uh, I thought you were already... Oh, my mistake... Pure little runt who keeps bothering me about joining the guild. So, uh, only the toughest and most dangerous guild in the high seas, of course, the Marauders Guild. My job is to recruit new members. Uh, shall I deem them worthy of her? Uh, what does this guild do? Mostly we take contract contracts killing pirates, venturing into dangerous places for rare items, you name it. Okay, whatever the contract requires. Sounds like my kind of guild. Do uh, you think you're good enough her, uh, maybe? Okay. Uh, I need to know uh, you went all bark and no bite. A contract uh, just came in a couple of days ago. The client wants a pirate captain dealt with. Uh, by dealt with, I mean dead, uh, six feet under, closed curtains and all. Uh, can you handle it? With my eyes closed, there we go. Okay, so we've got a new quest as well. We'll do the cartographer thing, though. 
Uh, there's a blacksmith as well. We can go and buy various wares and stuff on it. Special weapons. So, yeah, we can buy some stuff. I'm just going to leave it all at the moment. I think we'll just get out there and uh, do this pirate quest, I think, is our first job. Let's go and just do that. Although, the it is going dark, isn't it? Yeah, the sun's going down. I think we might want to rest because, yeah, I, I took me ages to find and get used to all the navigating. And I was out there in the dark and it, yeah, wasn't good. So uh, we might as well just run around and see whatever other quest everybody has, I think. And we'll kind of go from all there. Right. So, uh, bonjour. You may call me Le Chef. I am here to serve the needs of your taste buds. You're a chef? Indeed, uh... Though, if I'm being honest, I prefer to call myself a miracle worker with the lack of ingredients. Uh, it almost takes an act of God uh, to whip up a delicious meal, but I'm quite capable and no need to worry. All right, and let's see what you've got. Can you teach me to cook? Afraid not, though. Getting getting started isn't all that difficult. You need only to find a recipe, gather the ingredients, and find a good stove. All right, then. And then he's got a bunch of stuff. That's fine. Okay, can I take any of your stuff? No. Okay, yeah, the sun's going down, so uh, it took a long time to get here. So who's Find this guy? Traveller. That's ah, just a regular guy. I guess he's uh, nothing. Uh, fisherman. Ooh, hello there, Traveller. I haven't seen you before, or, or have I? Who knows? After three bottles of uh, Rogue's Rum, I can't remember where my nose is. Am I right? Uh, I'd like to browse your shop. Are you a fisherman? Don't really care fishing. Uh, what gave it away? Uh, yes, I'm a fisherman, all right. And I cast a line and wait for a little nibblers uh, to come. You a fan of fishing? I sure am. There you are. All right, so he's just got another shop again. So fishing lures, fishing pole, a bunch of stuff like that. Ooh, treasure hunter's hook. Ooh, interesting. Interesting. Okay, so what is this place? Tavern? Alright, let's go in there. Gotta go in the tavern, surely. Welcome to my inn. Welcome How to my I inn. Assist you? What make make yourself at home and uh, say you wouldn't be interested in helping out an old innkeeper. Uh what do you have in mind? I used to be a big time gambler around here and was very good with the dice. Any game involving dice I win. Over the years I became a collector of sorts. Collect all kinds of dice and unique designs. I've recently come across a new design. They call it the Gambler's Dice. I've heard enough. Not interested. All right. They have a unique cut uh, to uh, uh, to them instead of the traditional shapes, uh, squares, uh, squared edges. Okay, so I guess you'll want me to find a bunch of those, right? Hope you aren't too shy about using uh, your, your that blade of yours. Okay, shouldn't be. Uh, shouldn't I just ask them nicely? There we go. Find. I'll find your dice. So there we go. So the one wants a dice. The other one wants. Assuming can I sleep in those houses? Ooh, that's a good point. Yeah, it's, it's getting really dark now. So yeah, can I sleep here? It's a tavern. Can I sleep? Or do you want to rest until sunrise? Yes, I do. Oh, there we go. I'll take that. Yeah, there we go. Cool. Right, let's let's get going now. So we just got to head north. Grab these things as well. Grab anything we can. It'll level us up a little bit. So uh, we've just got to head north. Uh, oh, hang on. I've fallen off the edge. I think we can just respawn this thing as well. Yeah, place it back down so I don't have to back it out or anything. I don't think there are Bruce's. I hope there aren't. We don't need you, Bruce. So, let's get our compass out first. So, we've got to head that way. Yeah, we've just got to head north. Right, okay. Let's get going then. Let's go in here. Sunset effect is pretty cool as well. I like it. So, we'll kind of head... Oh, it's probably that island there. I can just see something in the distance. That's probably it. I my guess. Just take a quick bearing. Possibly it might be past that one. We'll have to see. No, I think that might be it. That looks like that could be it, doesn't it? So, yeah. 
Let's get over there and then we'll take out some pirates. We'll just take a quick uh, reading with the sextant as well. Seven east and it was. Four north, wasn't it? Okay. So, yeah, I suspect that's it. Yeah, one north. I'm going to guess that's possibly it. Right, okay. I think this might be the island here. We're seven east and three north, so we're pretty close to it. Um, I think this might be the island. It looks that way, so um, I'm going to suggest... I'm going to take a guess that it is. So let's go with it. This looks like some carved rocks or something, so... Uh, we'll just make our way on foot. I, I believe we can spawn the ship. Ooh, hang on. Let's just uh, raise the sail, lower the sail. There we go. Four. There we are. That's perfect. So we should be there. Ooh, looks like there's some iron or some copper or something we can mine. Let's mine that up. And we'll take all of that. Is that it? Ah, that's it. Okay, fair dues. Right, let's get our cutlass out. Our trusty cutlass. And I do want to try and kill a deer. Probably need a gun or a bow or something for that. Right, so let's see if we can find these pirates. I don't know where they are though, but let's see if we can find them. I'm assuming they're going to be further inland. And there's also going to be a lot of other nasty wildlife that we're going to have to keep our eyes peeled for. I just quickly threw a save to that save down as well, because uh, you never know, I might need to be a safe scum. So this is right, right? Yeah, we're right on it. So I am just looking for a pirate then. Where are you, Mr. Pirate? Or Mrs. Pirate, either way. We need to take you out. Yeah, I love the graphic. I love the art style. Nice art style. Um... Assume there's like a pirate lair or something. Okay. They weren't on the water, were they? Yeah, I'm not seeing any pirates. Can we kill this deer? Just chase it down. <laughs> okay. Some damage to it. Where is it? Oh boy. Hang on, I'm seeing a boar. I don't want to mess with that. Just to get... Aha! Here we go. Hopefully I don't have any firearms or anything. Or any, like, bows or anything. Because, um, yeah, all I've got is a cutler. So, I'm going to hope you don't have anything like that. Okay, alright. Oh, God, he has got a... Alright, run away, run away. Uh, I need to put some healing items on my person. Oh dear. Food. Eat that. Can't do that during combat. Oh, great. Alright, mate. You're shooting me in the wrong... Uh, okay. <laughs> oh, there we go. Ah, I've got the cartographer's thing. Um... Where is the health potion? I'm going to put that on number four, I think, for the moment. There we go, because we definitely want that. There we are. That's good. I think there was another one, or was there? Let's take all that stuff. Have they all got the cartographer's thing? Let's go. I want to loot this place. Let's go in. Oh, there's a lot of them, but let's go for... Oh, hang on. Probably need to do a block. There we go. Block. Oh god. Uh, uh. Oh dear. Okay. Right. <laughs> well, we did that. Um. We got it saved, can't we? We can be a save scum. We got the we got the cartographer's thing. I just really want to get in there and loot. I mean, I don't know. Is there loot in there? I have no idea, but... Ooh, there we go. Yeah, there is. Take the die. Let's grab what we can. Bananas. Ugh. We'll eat them if we have to. But... Let's see what we can find. Ooh. Miner's Guide. Well, we'll 
We'll worry about that later. I don't think there's too much to it. Just uh, mine the rocks, but there we go. Yeah, we kind of got to loot everything, haven't we? I just could do with some more. Um, uh, I guess I could eat one of those, which would get me some more health back, wouldn't it? There we go. Whilst we're out of combat. And then let's come for this guy next. So if I block, he then takes a swing. Hey, there we go. Oh. Oh, well, leveled up though. But yeah, that's a shame he didn't have anything on him. Alright, there's just one more by the looks of it. So we may as well... Oh, there's two more. Oh no, there's three more. Okay. Alright, let's see if we could just kite one over. Hello? Come on. We are not doing much damage to this guy, are we? Oh, he's got like a green name, so that probably means you're like a badass, right? You're like heavy leveled or something. Ow. Ooh, there we go. Something else. Uh, let's eat a little bit of that as well. Get some health back. There we go. I kind of want to loot this whole place now, so let's go for it. It's just, yo, mate, come here. You know what? We'll go around to the other guy. Kind of standing guard, isn't he, in the centre there? Let's kind of just draw this one over if we can. Hello, hello, come on, come away. It's like zomboid. We just gotta kite everyone over. And we're leveling up at the same time. I'm going to get like a flintlock or a, well, I guess a bow, wouldn't it? Either way, I'd be fine. I think the block is actually uh, sucking my uh, stamina down. Oh, there we are. Take what we can. We've leveled up to three, right. Got one more to take down. Let's go for it. Though, oh, there's just a. Oh come on, they're not both attacking me. Oh, oh my god. Okay, that was a mistake. Sorry, Captain. I think we're just going to swing wildly instead. Seems to be working out all right, doesn't it? Hoping you have something good. Oh god, there's another bloody pirate coming in. Health potion. Damn it, where the hell did you come from? Are you a pirate? Yes, you are. Okay. <sighs> okay. <laughs> right, can I loot this place now? Is that cool if I loot it? I don't know, it probably wasn't worth it, but there we go. Uh, let's take all the stuff. I want all the stuff. I want your wooden bowl, I want it all. Uh, let's take the bottles. Ooh, ooh, a tricorn hat. Well, we've got to have that, haven't we? Can't be a pirate without one of those. That is the essential pirate equipment right there. So, uh, the Book of Slave and Kings. Okay. I wonder if we can read those later. Doesn't seem like we could. Can I take that with me? Along with the other book as well. Uh, next, previous. So I can read the pages, but yeah, I don't seem to be able to take it with me. That's a shame. All the other books. I think it's just um, a bit of backstory and that sort of thing. Uh, like the mining thing is probably just a uh, tutorial as well. Oh, there's a workbench. Interesting. Oh, I can make a bow. Oh, if I had some more... Plant fibers, I can make a bow. That would be kind of cool. Oh, some wooden logs. Snap, there we go. Uh, can I get in that? Got the bottle. I don't know whether I need these empty bottles or what, but we're taking everything. We are leaving nothing behind. 
just take it all. Uh, there's a tent up there. Can I? Oh no, it's just this thing. Yeah. Okay. All right. Uh, let's get up here. It's mostly just rope. A bit of glass. We'll have all of that. Oh, there's a bow. Never mind. A. Hey, uh, sneak by pressing C on the keyboard or right thumbstick on the gamepad. While sneaking, uh, attacks deal extra damage to unaware enemies. Oh. So, just like, uh, you know, the fallouts or something like that. Okay. Yeah, I think that's just story stuff. Broken climbing gear. Ooh. Oh, and then like a big... Use the pirate captain's key to unlock. Okay. Uh, many equipable items such as armor and weapons have talents and customization. Inspect the items. Uh, see the talent tree. Talents on the items are randomized. Oh. We've got like a raider's axe or something. Storage chest. Aha. Yeah, I'm digging this game. This is pretty cool, actually. Um, I forgot to mention at the start as well. I will do Stalker. Um, I've just uh, I've just got to optimize it and run it and do all of that stuff. It takes a bit of time as well. I forgot to mention that at the start of the video, but uh, there we go. Uh, blacksmith. Ah, right. I think I've already emptied that. So I think I've got pretty much everything. Uh, but yeah, I've I've installed Stalker and all of that sort of stuff. But yeah, I've just got to uh, actually play a little bit of it because I haven't played it yet. And then also, uh, you know, get some optimization and stuff down as well. Because, um, yeah. Oh, he was in another camp. I get you. Oh, it was a little separate camp here. Parchment. Take the cheese. Take the banana. We'll take the parchment. Take the copper. Take the fishing hook. It's going to take everything. Ah, it's a bunch of those things. Leave nothing nailed down, people. Leave nothing nailed down. Right, there we go. Uh, so we should, I should just be able to spawn. Take all the plant fibers, we'll take that as well. Uh, this is the copper, let's go and equip that. We may as well mine it, there we go. Uh, but yeah, like I was saying, I've installed the Stalker Gamma mod. I've just got to um, optimize it and that sort of thing and a few little uh, frame drops and stuff like that and then i've got to actually play it as well so i haven't really played it yet so played about half an hour which seems really awesome but um yeah i've not played it yet so let's sail back we'll cash this in and then we'll call it a day i think there we go yeah i'm digging this game it's pretty cool can we go under the water or not maybe as long as there's no bruises i'm all cool with that right so let's get going we need to sail back down to uh, it would just head south, isn't it, really? Let's go that kind of direction over there somewhere. Oh, yeah, a little bit of lag when you uh, sort of generate uh, the islands and stuff like that. But, uh, you know, other than that, that's pretty cool. So let's just, I think it's going to get dark as well. Uh, let's just go. Yeah, so basically we've just got to sail south, haven't we? So, yeah. So let me do that. We'll cash that in and then we'll call it an episode, I think. Okay, right, here we are. It's the morning. I've slept because it was pitch dark by the time I got back. So let's come into here to the cartographer and we'll cash in this mission. So there we go. Got it right here. Beautiful. Oh, how I've missed uh, my little compass. So golden and so precious. Um, excuse me. Uh, well, you've done as I asked. As uh, as promised, here's enough for supplies to build the wave skipper. You can use the cartographer station over there to build it. Come, let's talk to me once you've done that. Okay, brilliant. So, let's come over to here. Wave skipper. Oh. Did you not... Um, what? The bigger the ship, the better the sailor. Got it right here. Did I... Oh, there we go. That didn't finish for some reason I'll take that there are four denominations copper silver gold platinum so 100 of each okay that's cool uh, 100 coins will automatically upgrade to a single coin there we go okay right now we can craft that thing there we go brilliant so we've just built the wave skipper awesome let's just put that down what do we do with our old one just leave it there I guess because we just leave it there right so speak to the cartographer I just I want to pop it down if I can Oh, there we go. Yeah, we got our own boat. Cool. Let's get on it. We'll, we'll talk to the cartographer in a minute. 
Let's not worry about that now. I want to get on my new vessel. Oh, damn. And then I believe we can build workstations and stuff on this vessel. Um, I don't know if there's another vessel that we can upgrade to a bigger one. But, um, yeah, that's cool. That's a pretty good start. I wonder if we get cannons and stuff on this thing. Uh, but anyway, I'll say, I think for now, I think this is a good place to call it. And I think we'll end the episode here. Yeah, so if you like this one and want to see more of it, let me know. And uh, I'll do some more. But I'm possibly going to do some more anyway. I'll say I'm recording these ahead of time. So, um yeah, I might do another one and then see what you guys think to it. But um, yeah, I'll say for now, I think this is where we'll call it and we'll end the episode. So if you like that one, please give me a thumbs up. Comment your thoughts down below. Subscribe for more. I really do appreciate it. Stay safe out there, everyone. And I'll catch you next time.